Uh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of our Cold Drill Friday. I'm Joel Trey. This is Tim Kelly. Uh, Tim, you tell, tell us about the drill we're going to shoot today. Sure. All right, so today we're going to be shooting the rafter drill. This is a drill made up by a, a good friend of mine, a scout sniper buddy of mine. We trained a lot together and, and he, uh, he ran this by me the other day and I shot it with him and I really, really enjoyed the drill. Um, so it's, it's called a rafter drill, R-A-F-T-T-E-R. -T -T -E stands for rapid fire, target transition, and emergency reload drill. So what he's gonna do, he's gonna start with a magazine of 10 rounds. He's gonna have another magazine of two or just another magazine on standby, right? He's gonna, he's gonna draw from, five, from the five yard line, place five rounds and the first three by five index card. And then he's gonna immediately transition to the next index card, fire five more rounds. At that point in time, his gun's gonna run, run dry and hopefully run the slide lock. And then he's going to do an, perform an emergency reload He's got to slow it down and place two rounds inside this two inch circle. Now, the two inch circle, I will say, that's what gets you because you only have a 10 second par time. So you gotta be quick getting out of the holster. You have to be very controlled and focused and, and make sure you maintain all of your hits and both of these index cards and then have the stability to control your hits um, in the final two shots. So uh, yeah, that's it, man. I'm right, ready. Man. I'm psyched. You ready? Yeah, let's do it. Sounds good. All right, Trey Joel. Here we go, man. You understand the course of fire? Yes, sir. All right, here we go. Stand by. Nice job. Clean run. 1081. Dang it. Took too long in that first nut card. That's all, hey, that's a hell of a shoot, man. I'm all right with that. Yeah, that's pretty good, dude. All right, so Trey's first shot on target was 197. It looked like he was maintaining some half second splits. So it's five, three, five, one, four, nine, four, seven. His transition to the next target for his sixth shot. His transition was 0.61, so he was almost as fast in his transition as he was his splits. Seventh shot was 4.6, 4.5, 4.4, four, four, four. so he sped it up just a touch, just a touch there at the end. His tenth shot, his, his very last split was uh, 43. His mag change got him a little bit, 366. That's how long it took him to get his 11th shot off. But you have to remember that's a mag change and really dialing in on that two inch, that two inch circle. And then uh, the split was three quarters of a second, roughly. So um, ended up all in all to 1081. My, uh, my thoughts on this is if he would have started off as quick as he was at the uh, on his um, on his second index card, if he was started off at that speed, I think he would have been right at 10 seconds. Right at 10 seconds. All in all, it was a great run. All right, guys. So there you have it. That's the uh, cold drill Friday for this week. Um, again, that's the rafter drill. All in all, I think Trey did really well. He shot the go the, the drill clean. Um, he just missed it by just less than a second. So. Um, like I said, all in all, I think you did really well, man. What do you think? Yeah, I, I really enjoyed it. I actually got pretty excited. I thought I actually made it in time and <laughs> clean. Um, I think you're right. If I sped up here a lot, a little bit, I would have been better. But I think what really caught me was my mag stuck. That's right. In the reload. And I had to fish that out. And I think if I didn't fish it out, it would have put me just, just like 10 seconds. Yeah, you're right. Man. But um, it's a fun drill. It's fun something that had some reloads and transitions. And I like it. Yeah, sure, man. All right, well. I got nothing else to say. All right. Close us out. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and comment down below what we should do next week. Thanks for watching. Thanks, guys. We look forward to seeing you out here. His reload. You might as well just shut up now. <laughs> it won't stop. <laughs> <laughs> Zach. Yeah.
Go get my button. Go hit my button. Make sure the camera hears it. I thought I can't hear anything from behind anyway. If I had the right mic, it could. Oh. And something that loud in here. Don't ever do that again. All right, well, there's our outtake. <laughs>